I knew I knew I had to hit the start button. Okay, I'm not, okay, okay. So, but the the major problem is that I I don't remember what we're doing. Um. Wow, that is a good game. Well, we're in the 1500s. Uh, we oh. Marguerite, Marguerite is waiting. She was in the Squire's Minor Manor. Manor. Murner. And then the Murner is south. over here. Great. No, it's south. It's uh, south. That's more or less this direction. <laughs> we're, we're working on like a PSP compass. And so. Oh, yeah. Oh, please let me go around. No. Oh. Oh, wait. Is that it? Isn't it? I don't know. Where are we in the thing? It's just unclear with this, um... Hopster. This generation. Hopster. I don't know. Haupt, sir. Market plots. Market plots. Or marked plots. Sorry, my bad. There's a person with a briefcase. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it's matter? Marguerite. It's just that she looked like her. I'm, who I'm pretty Marguerite sure is our daughter. Yes, oh, but yeah. I lost sight of her. Maybe it wasn't even her. She was saturated well, at all. <laughs> I need to go home now. Is that all right? <laughs> wow. Sorry about that. You're creeping me That's out, mister. Okay. <laughs> I gotta you really go. You are from a different world altogether, aren't you? Wait, now is she into that? I, uh... Well, well, well she... It's... I mean, it's been... Do you, do you remember she she Don't was worry. aware of that I, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. About the things right. you've told me. Not that anyone would believe me anyway. It was just how she worded it. Mm-hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Not that anyone would believe me. Because sci-fi hasn't really been invented yet. <laughs> I don't think I should be leaving anything behind in this age. Not just actual things, but talking about stuff too, like I just did. <laughs> dude, dude. Okay. Let's explain it in like detail, the thing that I shouldn't do. That's dreadful. <laughs> okay, what you need to do is you need to shut your mouth and stop talking. Well, anyway. Yeah, but he's a white guy, so you know. Yeah, well, so he feels dominion over <laughs> history. <laughs> so. I just meant that he's incapable of not talking. <laughs> kids and grandkids will not be no uh, offense. It's true. It's true. <laughs> their descendants in to anyone listening who happens to be a white guy. Yeah, you're doing great. Good if, job. If, if, you're, if you're actively not one of those people, we're not talking about you. That's the thing. So, the more I interfere with the past, the more the future will change. It may not be as serious as that example I just used, but anything I do here could affect the future. Like stopping a fire in the thing? I... What? Like saving your family? Like... I don't understand yet. But I'll sleep on it. Your time period is very interesting to me. Uh... I wish I could see it. It's nothing exciting. Sometimes you just kind need a good sleep really. to really <laughs> I still want to see get a good life. awareness of your I don't scenario. Know why, but I feel such a strong pull towards it. It's Please almost as if I'm your daughter. Your no, I can't do that. It's not possible. The future will change. After all, you're my. Huh? You're what? I think you may be. Oh, oh, we have oh, a choice. Oh, you get a choice. Uh, you gonna just be out front, or are you gonna like, oh, nothing? I'm gonna be up front. Why right, not? Do it. Wait a minute. Did I just say something? <laughs> what? I couldn't hear you. <laughs> what? I was saying it again, like double down. I mean, we're not that far from us where we saved, so fuck it. I can't it's tell if he's though I've looked up whether I'm descended from you or not. But you should forget about me and live a regular life. That was a world. weird way to say oh, what I suggested, I though. Mm -hmm. Ancestor, huh? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe she thinks we just don't know what the word means. Thought... <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, an ancestor. <laughs> sure. I... Uh... I didn't mean... I'm sorry if I've been a bother. I was out alone. So was she into us, and she's like, oh, maybe I'm your great-great-great-grandma? Oh. Awkward. <laughs> well, it... Yeah. That, At least it's not like one of those visual novels where the person's like, that's my fetish. <laughs> I mean, it seems to be her <laughs> fetish. And someday, based on how sad that like wall lean is. And, die. and it's all been decided already, hasn't it? And then my child will have a child and that child too. And all the way at the end of that repetition is you. That's what you mean. Oh boy. She and should totally clock us over the head, take our book, and then, like, <laughs> like abscond. 
I mean, that's not a bad Something plan if you meet a time maybe. traveler because, like, yeah, you suddenly yeah. have unlimited power. I don't have any memory of my parents, so. Also, why would you go to the where they're from? I go farther forward. Like, <laughs> oh yeah. You will come over again, won't you? She got Tell better. All these wondrous things. That's allowed, isn't it? Or, or, or this is the brand, like the cutscene so branches, soon. like came together again, mm -hmm. and I don't know. Eight minutes. Okay, so what, what, what are we doing now? Um, Marguerite, I think you're my ancestor. I muttered to her in a low voice. Oh, okay. Uh, so we don't know what to do. Yeah, I guess I'll just fuck off. Oh. Uh, oh, that's right, because you can get in the house and oh, go all sorts please. of weird places in it. Oh, no, just let me go. Okay. okay. You can go in the basement again. I could, but I'm down there, and I'm an old grumpity fart. Oh. <laughs> Oh, Hugo. Dun, dun, Did you just dun. get back? I'm still pretty sure she's our daughter. Nope. I heard everything. I didn't mean to be a snoop, but uh, it you didn't absolutely seem like did, I could dude. just walk in. <clears throat> it's okay. I won't tell anyone. What a For little shit. Hugo. You can tell that no, Hugo is immediately going to tell like everybody. Yeah. After all, sis, I was just trying to be tactful. That's quite all right. Should we uh, go back and change that? Uh, I don't know. Oh, um, Hugo? Tell anyone and I'll murder you! Oh, no. What? Are you still, you know, mother's lock of hair? What? Uh, what? Uh, what? I know how much you miss mother, but you can't carry that thing wow, around Wow, like public shaming him as like a... Because <laughs> like we're still standing here. What do you mean that I thing? Know. How could you say something like that? Hugo, it's, it's just doing anything wrong. It's just kind of weird, you see. Yeah, but bringing it up like I'm sorry. Right now. I know. Right. I know. Wait, she clearly has a little lock of hair as well on her pouch in her weird? pouch. You're the one who's being weird, changing the subject as soon as it gets a little thorny. What? Hugo. It's just a coin purse, right? No, it's probably a lock of hair purse. Mm. They were all the fashion in 1538. It, it was it was a that. weird thing. It swept the nation. Everyone, or at least this one little hamlet. <laughs> Father can't be disturbed. Lo local I fashion know. is often inexplicably I, uh, uh, I should get confusing going. and weird. It was yeah, the meme of the time. I'm sorry, it was so. There were a lot of mothers here. with much shorter hair around that time. <laughs> it's always like this. I just can't do a thing with him once he gets upset, so I just leave him alone when he gets this way. I wish my hey, hair sis, could be long again. Are you sure again. you just want to let him go like this? Stop that, Hugo. Jeez, the little punk is just listening behind every door. <laughs> is he encouraging oh. her to make out with us? Uh, I I have something for you. Will you take it? Consider it a token of appreciation um, for all the stories you've told it's me. It's a floppy disk. Oh, it's a comb. Oh. <laughs> floppy disk. I found this. When I touch it, I sometimes see Makes a picture me... of this man in my head. He's uh, not anyone I've met. He's much, much older, mm, like she's my father's us a, age. Mm, I have this sensation like he's patting me on the head, but it doesn't feel weird at all. Uh, <laughs> that's a that. kink, girl. <laughs> <laughs> and also incredibly specific. Like, when I touch this now. comb, I see no, a man uh, and I feel not. him patting my head. Maybe he's my dad But or I feel not. really and good about it. it. Yeah. Do you feel that way when you hold the comb? <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> yes, uh, something to remember today uh, by. Good job, this sis. Comb Hugo, stop eavesdropping. God, Hugo is Thank you, such a shit bag. You. Oh, okay. See you later. Oh, uh, wow. Will she see? If there later? was an option that was like pat her on the head. <laughs> All right. What's what's up with the comb? Comb. A precious gift from. Oh, oops. <laughs> you should have had a cutscene of the guy patting you on the head. <laughs> um, I don't know. Right. You have well, to keep looking around a little. Let's keep looking at the journal. Yep. Oh, no, we still just muttered to her in a low voice. Uh, I guess I'm It's just what we've done, not like what we need to be doing. Well, so look around and maybe talk to someone. It was good for that for that uh, hint to meet her. Well, but we already knew we had but... to meet her. Like, Yes. Uh, hmm. God, what even? So, hold on. I I feel like I'm forgetting something. We kind of did a side branch, I think. Mm. Right? Like, wasn't there something else we, we could be doing? No, fuck. Damn it. 
if we go into the journal and we go up, use the Philosopher's Stone, key to the laboratory, blah, blah, blah. Aren't there any clues about the house that exploded? But the house that exploded was not in the 1500s, right? It was like in the 1800s? Uh, but do you see how there are these check marks? Yeah. On some of them? Yeah, yeah. If we go down a bit... Okay, well... If we go down a bit, I no, you just embarrass myself. No, you did one that didn't have a checkbox. Yes, that was in chapter four. Oh. Guess oh, no, but we did a steel plate. Why do some of them have checkboxes and some don't? I don't know. Mm. Okay, but anyways, so we went to the bar to get something to eat. Borrowed a book. The sea rabbit anted. What? Oh, yeah, the library. Weren't we going to do something involving the library? Yeah, let's go up to the library. Which I think northeast going into the future. Or... No, go up in the north. Go up here first, and we'll. Or wait, I thought it was northeast. I think it's actually southeast. That's the atelier. Well, because I don't the... think the library exists in this time period. Oh. Right. It's like you know the like the seventies yeah, yeah. or something like that. <clears throat> so let's go to the future. I said to the future. Um. Which originally exists. I'm yeah. Look. Oh. Well, what does the top one say? Because it's highlighted. Uh, the time oh. in which I originally exist. Okay. Because it was just it was glowing. Yeah. 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 yeah okay. For sure. Um, young Eckert was here. Which. Oh, who's Eckert? Are we Eckert? No, we aren't. Okay. Whatever. No, that's the time yeah. of Marguerite. Yeah, we're gonna go see Alfred okay. and the others again. Sure. To the future. Whoa. Blub, blub, blub. Do you think that orb happens in real time, or is it like time stops as the orb is appearing? Or mm -hmm. I think it's weird that there's duplicates of us, and then it warps us in. I also like that we went out to the middle of the square to do it, just to like fuck with the timeline slightly more. I know. <laughs> hey, what's up with you? Good morning. Finally, the spring thaw has come to Lord Alfred. Uh. What? Look at There's his a... arms. <laughs> what a joyous occasion. He's got like a weird beard too. <sighs> What's up with you? Ah, so that's what happened with Lord Alfred now, is it? What is? There's a green orb back there you might want to grab since it's like literally right there. Hey, if you want to save time, can you just say Grorb? Grorb? Yeah, it'll, okay. it'll help a lot with the LP. All right. It actually uh, is a speed running technique. Hmm, same yeah. Grorb. That was the... Is it? Yep. It's Brum Museum, right? That's the library? Well, I think I think we changed it so it became a museum instead of a library. Although, I think the implication oh. is that it was... I don't know. Okay. I'm still oh, this is sure, Eckert. Okay, right. Mm -hmm. What? You don't want to turn it into a museum? Well, I thought about that, but I've got a lot of books, too. <laughs> <laughs> a library wouldn't be a bad idea. Wait, what did we think? need it to be a library for something? Because we needed research material? I think I think we do. I think we need it to be a library. Right. Okay, you've helped me make up my mind. Random a stranger? <laughs> well, remember, we're not a random stranger. We're a random stranger who took a photo of him at the opening of his music. Wearing a mime outfit. <laughs> but I could have sworn that was in a different timeline. Oh, wait, I don't need to go in oh. here. So now I can, I think, go to the future. And experience a library? Yeah. Uh. Or do you want the intermediate step? I don't. Is that is that? Oh, that is an intermediate step. Yeah, because that maybe we. I don't know. Let's wait. That's where we were. Let's, let's maybe yeah. talk one more time just to. I'm still not sure. Oh. Oh. Oh, so we can rent like switch it back and oh. forth. Oh. What's the other? What's yeah? What's he have to say? Oh, never mind. He's been procrastinating like this for a while now. Talk it over with him, will you? Decide what to do with this place. I mean, really. <laughs> it's... Wow, okay. Sure, whatever, buddy. Yeah, all right. Cool. So we're, we're going to go cool, to the cool, 70s, cool. I think? Or are we going to go... I think we're going to go to the 70s. Okay. Uh, I hope I'm not using up all my uh, well, That's grubs. why you got to pick up some more grubs. Yeah. See, already we've saved, like, almost a fifth of a second. 
Whoa, 2001 A Space Odyssey was a good movie. Whoa. 1979. Okay, cool. So we're post Summer of Love. Yeah. That was what, 76 or something? Oh, Summer of Love was like 67. Oh, 69. shit, really? Oh, yeah. Well. It is closed now. Oh, it's nighttime. Oh. But you might find an orb or something out here. Yeah, maybe I'll go look. Oh, but I also don't want the top. Uh... <clears throat> There's a back door. We'll go. We'll go take a look at that. We also do need to be careful of the present day not advancing too far forward, which up until now hasn't really been a problem. But uh, it could be a problem. Maybe. Mm, I don't know. Wow. Do you think we'll ever be done with X trees? Oh, I want to talk to you. Come back here. No. <laughs> but he's been training. You can't. You can't do it. That's okay. He doesn't know how to take the hypotenuse. <laughs> well, well, another early riser. Uh, okay. Mm. Oh, that was useful. Yeah, great. Great. I I guess I'll I guess I'll go to the other timeline. There's I'll, at least an orb. A grub. Yeah, there we go. Oh, if, you know, you just lost this time right there. Mm. Oh. Did we actually explore around this air like this timeline? I don't, know. I don't remember. What's your map say exists in this timeline? Cafe. Uh, well, it's super early, right? So we don't have option Photoshop. Hmm. Oh, interesting. Is that Oh, it's early. The bakery. Oh, the bakery. You think? Get we... yourself a croissant. Heck right. yeah, man. Let's go. Let's go to the. Or what, what's, a, what's a German bread that you'd find at a bakery? Uh, I don't know. I also don't know. I can't have bread. Oh, God. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm uniquely asking the wrong person here. Like, I just can't. Uh, I want bread, but I can't have it. The forbidden. The forbidden wheat. Mm -hmm. Oh dang it! Damn, I mean, and you just know they're in there yucking just, it up. I just know that there's going to be some side quest to get someone like a bun, some oh, kind of bun. Absolutely, and I need this bun. So then, and then I'll give you a gun. I'll give you a gun for this bun. You can call it a bun gun. Uh, uh, we just call it a bun. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yes. Thank you for. You should go to the present. I think we're ready. We are ready. It seems to warp you to a particular spot, mm -hmm. I think. Whoa! Oh, oh. The game briefly goes 4 3. I wonder if there are a limited number of orbs. Mm, they seem to respawn. Okay. So, uh, fun update. Um, so, my previous upstairs neighbors. Um, they had a dog mm -hmm. and it would sometimes run laps yep back and forth and it was quite annoying uh i don't ent entirely understand what's going on now though that because there seems to be something or someone upstairs running laps I, I believe like a baby or a child uh didn't sound great there's another gorb so i I've, I've been listening this morning constantly to the sound of bu -bu 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 -bu. Mm. And it's not a it's not a problem because I think it's only going to happen on the weekends. I'm pretty sure is when the kids here. Oh, but it's just kind of a bummer because I was really excited to be to have escaped the the loud noise all the time. Yeah. Oh God, so I need to. Do... So it's a library now. Is it? Uh, did it say? No, but I mean, yeah. There we go. It's a library. Is being <laughs> busy happy? Happy? No. Taking walks for your health. Oh, hey. Sweet. I kind of come. Is this the book we needed? <laughs> Apparently. Sea hair poison. The female sea hair is very poisonous. The only way to survive poison is by taking the antidote. The person poison can only survive the number of days that the sea hair from. Oh, this is poorly written. The this number of days that the sea hair from where the poison was extracted had survived. Okay. After that time period has elapsed, the person poisoned will die instantaneously. Among the various antidotes, the best ones that derive from the male sea hair, if this is used when one starts feeling the effects of the poison, he will soon start feeling the curing effects. However, this poison no longer exists in our time is unfortunate that we can no longer feel the effects of this antidote. Uh, okay. <clears throat> if only we had a solution to this. Right? Okay, so who was poisoned? Was it us? Yes. Okay. So we read that book. Oh, now we can warp back and get a male sea hair. 
Yes, and I think it's going to tell us... All the way back? Yeah. Her father sells medicine. I'll ask him about the antidote. Zoop. We're going to go ask ourselves about the antidote. Is that what's going to happen? Well, no, because we're super far back. So it's going to be... What's her name? Well, Margaret, Margaret right? Margaret, yeah. yeah. I keep but saying Marguerite. I, I know. I keep thinking Marguerite also. Uh, but her father, right? Yeah. Who I'm pretty sure is us. Oh, quite possibly. I wouldn't touch him. Right. Oh, hey, look, it's uh, it's snowing, probably. Yeah. Pretty sure that's snow. Great. Unless it's like just worms coming out of the sky or something. Uh, worms. Mm-hmm. I mean, we're messing with time, so, you know. It yeah. rains frogs occasionally. Yeah, like frogs, worms. This It's such a good point. You just don't know so, what what's going to come from today? the sky when you fuck with time too much. Is there something around here called a sea hare antidote? What? What's the matter? Why do you need something like that? Uh, well... It's here on the shelf. Help yourself. We keep it in a jar by the father. by the salt and, spe- and salt and pepper. <laughs> salt and pepper. I mean, to be fair, I have an apothecary Thank cabinet you. in my I kitchen really that has. <laughs> You're welcome. Fifty-six different herbs and things. Yeah. Do you have to be particularly careful when uh, when cooking? Like, no. Most those are all the ones that are edible. We have a separate area for things that aren't edible for when we're making like candles or incenses and, and soaps and stuff. Hmm. Well, that, that makes sense. Well, yeah. that way there's no confusion. Uh, so you I'm don't just, accidentally. Uh, yeah. I'm just looking around for corpse. Mm. I found out that um the thing that frankincense is made out of is edible. Oh, yeah. It's like it has medicinal properties. It's just we typically just make incense out of it. That's kind of interesting. You can well, always go outside and look around a little bit for a gorb. Oh, I know. I just I just feel like there'd be one around the house, you know? Mm. Uh, and I'm wrong. That's fine. That's fine. Now that I've rummaged through all their belongings. Is it like Dragon Quest where you can like steal stuff out of the cabinet? I, God, like I every cabinet in Dragon Quest you can like take an item out of. Or you can at least open it. And people are just okay with that. Yeah, it's really strange. Mm. So, so you're you're cooking with the stuff that you use to make frankincense. What 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 would you use that for? Like I don't chili? remember. I just learned about it the other day. I see. Yeah. Well, like I, I had no idea because they said an herb, and I'm like, I don't know what that is. They're like, uh, people make frankincense out of it, or it's also called frankincense. I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, time to eat the thing. Uh, oh God. Jesus. <laughs> Nine seconds. There it is. I don't entirely understand. We warped back just now, but yeah. we were able to run around earlier. This game is using some very fuzzy bullshit. Hmm. Also, what did we just drink exactly? Male sea hair extract. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it's a little iffy. Oh, I'm gonna hold the comb. I feel like the guy I'm patting you. <laughs> <laughs> oh God! Oh, yes. Look how he's smelling the bat. Yes. <laughs> Oh, chapter five. Yeah, I love to save my data. That sounds great. In this still incredibly ambiguous save screen, it works. It's, yeah, because it's like PSP and yeah, yeah. Because I think normally the PSP like visual would come up. Well, but it but it still works. Yeah, because they. Yeah. Okay. All right. It's part of the OS that doesn't exist, so they just stubbed the OS. Well, I feel like the OS usually does exist. Well, maybe it's because we're using uh, the particular... An original PSP. Yes. Oh, okay. We're, what? Um, What's it about? It's about time travel. I'll never get this guy's movies. It's mis- Who watches this kind of stuff anyway? Did we, we did see this before, right? I don't think so. What was Meditating that weird head bob? <laughs> did you see that? Yeah, it was like a hair flip. Okay, this sounds pretty dull. What? Dude, uh, you need a sense of self-preservation. Uh, we're dying in four sec. Pause, 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 pause. No, I think this is like how the chapter begins, and then we do the puzzle. I thought maybe you could use the metal plate. Oh. Well, metal plates typically don't work against cars. But, but we, we didn't know try. what it was. I could. I no, would have. No, I was just excited about pulling out a frying pan. <laughs> don't give up. It's dangerous to be alone. Do something, do something. Or else you'll never break I guess we're going to the movie? I guess so. It's 
seems oddly plot relevant for some ridiculous reason. Wait, 2011 p.m. So we're. Hey, look! It's a poster for that new movie. What's it about? I never get this. I see. So I actually do need to do something. Oh, oh. okay. We oh, gotta like right. peace out. So, oh, maybe we have to change the movie so it's a better movie. <laughs> Yes, yes. Do we have to go back in time and become the director or something like that? <laughs> Give a better plot idea or just like crap on some dude's meditating man idea. And then he like gets so ashamed that he never makes the movie. I hope so. Some other writer gets an opportunity to make a better one. Oh, it's 1980 now. Uh Oh, yes. A bit of time has advanced. Yeah. Instead of 1979, 78. Ah, the one true god! Oh. He was trying to summon forth the feeling it's of a guy happened. patting him on the head. <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, buddy, I have this comb here. Yeah, touch this you comb. Uh -oh. You answered my call, didn't Oh, god. You? No, no, of course Now not. we're becoming a what deity. Talking about? I mean... No, 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 wait! This is some, like... What do you want from me? I've seen this episode of Star Trek TNG. <laughs> myself. And, and the fun part is My that it's not a Oli single episode. This is like seven or eight episodes. Just a novice at this point, but anyway, ever since I saw you a year ago, I've been meditating every chance I can get, channeling. Look, all I'm not one to make fun of people's voices, but like again. this finally, this voice is weird <laughs> for this for this role. Power. I will never forget this moment. Maybe I should base a movie on this. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, okay. We just caused the movie what to be created by coming be? back in time. A bold and moving drama about a man with miraculous I guess powers. So. We did. Or a science fiction I... blockbuster featuring a psychokinetic hero. Um, uh, hmm. Did both of those describe the meditating man? man? Not to betray his excitement, but let me ask you something. Which if should it be? Film, what kind tell of me, tell me be? now. Something. It should be about time travel. Sure. Let's fuck up the timeline. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's a pretty good angle. But what about the motivation <laughs> for his temporal wanderings? Uh, he's trying to make sure he doesn't get with his grandmother slash daughter. <laughs> I mean, that is, is that is that the primary <laughs> driving point? He needs something else. Like him desperately this point, trying, he's just not, trying, to trying to not to like completely annihilate time itself. Um, I feel like we're going to go with a love story. Are you? Or a thriller? What, what, what describes our, our scenario? I think it's a thriller. I don't think it's a love story. I see. Margaret wants it to be a love story, but we're like, no! <laughs> it's like Final Destination, but with time travel. <laughs> I mean, I think that oh, is wow. what we just came up with. <laughs> kind of. You In fact, that is it. what this is. You're Look, super yeah. right. Please, yeah. don't tell anyone about this project. Uh, you want your, your secret's safe with me, dude. I'm only gonna be in this time for like another 10 seconds. <laughs> but or I guess we need some more orb. gorbs. Yeah. Soul, it, it's not a gorb, it's a grorb. Well, that'll come later. Soul? Watch for it in theaters, though. Uh, yeah, right? I wouldn't be surprised if each grorb okay. is like someone's like distilled essence. Wait, if this is 1980, when is the present? I am. Because like really, 20 years later. Very sincerely. Oh, it took a long time to get this movie I off don't the ground. Call this a token of that feeling. Well, I mean, he's like oh. a. But here, <laughs> he's have just a doing comb. Like Accept work. this as a gift. In the name of this encounter. What? Uh, you sure? This looks like an antique. Oh, that's all right. It looks old, but it's just a It's replica. a Fabergé egg on a necklace? My why, family why has do we have so many... Genes, so are Fabergé eggs, like, we important like or things. do they symbolize something this for this? This is the kind of thing my father oh. likes to make. Maybe we should look up Fabergé egg facts after this. <laughs> so there are old-fashioned cameras and pocket watches all over his house. Oh, no. And what I like to do is give them to friends. Oh. Uh, Wait, did he just you. admit from stealing from no, his father to, like... You. I consider you one of Don't my worry greatest about it. benefactors, <laughs> you know? Just talking to you like this gives me something immeasurably valuable. Because I'm so really? annoying that other does. people don't even listen. Yes, it does. Absolutely. I buy friends with my dad's way, stuff. <laughs> but with my dad's vast Fabergé egg collection. Please, please, come on. Share some of your powers with me. You can't ask me to do that. Just I mean, deny your powers. Say, right? no, I don't have Try powers. I don't know what you're talking about, dude. We were just Goodbye. talking about a movie, like... I don't know why Kush no, is all wait. like, yeah, I go? definitely have powers. You just... I'm going to run away now. Also, have you noticed that he's built like Bayonetta? Mm, a little bit. The legs are pretty long. I mean, I... 
I, I would I would like to be like six four and have super oh. long legs. Oops. Oh, he's still trying to feel his head oh, being pat. You've come back. <laughs> I knew it. My powers are something to be reckoned with. Come, come in closer now. <sighs> uh, run. I don't think I should get. This <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Wait! Don't go! <laughs> All right. So you need a gorb. Um. Also, but we're not getting the go back. Also, have you noticed that it's a new running animation? Yeah, because we're in snow. But you should get off the main road so you can find like. Okay. Well, like over there in that little park over there, maybe. The little park uh, behind you. Oh, the near the Photoshop, which is maybe yeah, that over, guy's Photoshop. Over in there, like behind one of the things, maybe. Any gorbs? Hmm. Hello. I because I would not be surprised if there's a way to get stuck. That would be super rude. I mean, it would be rude, but uh, I just wouldn't really put it past this developer. And I don't think I'd put it past you to check out the next episode of Shadow of Memories. So thanks for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the subscribe button. And check out the details of our Patreon, which is in the end card in the video description. And stay tuned for Shadows of Destiny. Woo! Uh, or memories? Yeah. Uh, okay, bye. <laughs>